All right, you guys. So this reading will be for Cancer, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Cancer, we're going to see what's going on with you guys moving forward. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, Cancer. So, Cancer, this read will be for November. All right, Cancer, read for November. Moving forward. All right, Cancer, let's see what's going on. Cancers. So y'all, so did y'all know that Mars is in retrograde? Yes, Mars in retrograde Gemini is in Gemini, I believe. Yeah. All right, you guys. So I'm saying like this period for you, Gemini. Look, I called y'all Gemini Cancer. This this Mars is in Gemini, is retrograding in Gemini. But for you, Cancer, this means that I'm seeing like some of you guys are letting someone go. Friend, relationship, family member, okay, a situation. You, you're canceling out things that no longer serve you, Cancer. And I thought I, I should just say that, okay? Because that's what's going on since Mars in retrograde. So it's a lot, a lot of scattered energy, okay? All right, you guys. So let's dig deep. Let's see what's going on in the month of November for Cancer. Tell me what's going on in the month of November for Cancer. What's going on for my Cancer in the month of November? Cancer. All right, Cancer, we got here passion. Ooh, okay. Okay, I'm saying like, Cancer, there's there's a lot of passion here. It could be with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or they got this in their chart here, okay? This is this could be any sign that you're dealing with, Cancer, but there is passion here. It's going to be a spark between you and this person moving forward. This is the energy, y'all. This is that. This is exactly what I'm seeing, y'all. So there's a lot of passion here. I'm seeing like a chemistry. Okay, you're looking at their birth chart. They're looking at your, at, at, at chores. What I'm seeing is that some of you guys got the same moon sign or Venus. If not that, you you and this person has a lot of chemistry together. Y'all have a lot of things alike. That's what I mean, Cancer, okay? All right. <laughs> I'm also saying that you could be hooking up with someone that you're dealing with. Okay, I'm saying like a hookup. It's it's going to be a lot of passion this month between you and someone, okay? Okay, we got here the sword in the road. So, there's some clarity. It could be with an air sign, y'all. Okay, you can't make this shit up. Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius here. I'm seeing a lot of clarity, a lot of truth. Okay, okay. You're protected, okay? I just want to let you know that, Cancer. You're highly protected here. So I'm saying everything is going to be all good for you. Everything is going to be straight for you. So there's a lot of clarity and truth that's coming your way too as well moving forward, okay? From this person, this air sign, or this air sign moon here, okay? But like I said, Cancer, you're definitely connecting with someone. A strong magnetic chemistry that you have with someone okay y'all it's getting cold what we call it cuffing season you know these men need somewhere to stay you get what i'm saying <laughs> can't say no nah, for real what i'm saying that there's a lot of passion and chemistry here okay that you that you have with someone okay but you're highly protected so you good with this person okay i'm saying like you're good you're straight Okay, I'm saying like someone's gonna be honoring you as well. Okay, look, we have here healing heart, so you could be healing your heart as well, you guys. Okay, that's what I'm saying. Okay, I'm saying that you know it's something that you had to heal for from cancer, and you're finally being healed, and it's time to go out there and have fun. That's what I'm saying, cancer. Look, you cannot make this shit up. Okay, you're gonna be out there having fun, okay. And I'm saying that, like I said, you're going to be matching up with someone. It's going to be insane chemistry. You're going to have chemistry with this person that you're dealing with, okay? I like this 
cancer. I like this for y'all. <laughs> okay. And I, like I said, it, it could be something or someone that you're letting go. Okay, cancer. What this mean for you, we in retrograde in Gemini. Okay. Retrograding in the planet of Mars. Okay. We in Mars. All right, y'all. So let's let's clarify more about this. Tell me more about this for my cancers moving forward. Tell me more about this for my cancers. Sun. Ooh, we got here the page of swords. Okay. Tell me more about this page of swords. So there, there, there could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Okay. I'm saying walking on eggshells. Tell me. Okay. Tell me more about this page of swords. So, this is like a messenger. I'm saying like a messenger, y'all. Ooh-wee. This is about a Pisces. There's a Pisces that you're dealing with. Okay, watch out for the number 18 or 81 here. Okay, 888-111, y'all. This is what I'm saying. So, uh, I'm saying like a message. Cancer, you could be done with a fellow Cancer or a Pisces energy. Okay, I'm saying like a hidden message. Okay, tell me more about this moon, this page of swords. Y'all, it's getting deep. It's getting so juicy. Tell me more about the page of swords and the moon. Tell me more about this page of swords and the moon. Wow, it's another healing card. <gasps> you know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, Cancer, you're gonna, it's like you're gonna be healing from a Pisces or a Cancer. Like I said, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. It's something that you had to do in order to grow, okay? It, it's some sort of sacrifice in November. That you will have to do in order to grow here. That's what I'm saying, you guys. Because what I'm saying, you're going to be healing. You're, you're going to be healing your heart. Healing your emotions here. I want to tell me more about this moon here. about the moon for cancer why is the moon here okay what we got here <gasps> oh cancer you wanna mm, you're gonna find out something yeah you're gonna find out something okay you could be dealing with a leo i'm saying like a leo energy this is crazy tell me about the sun you had to heal from something that was hidden, Cancer. I'm gonna be real. Okay? Something was in the dark. You had to heal from it. Okay? You had to heal from a Pisces or this air sign or this Leo energy. I'm saying like healing energy. You had to. All right? We got the Ace of Cups. Okay? Now that you heal from a certain situation, a certain person, I'm saying that the Ace of Cups is here. Like, new love, new found love, new situation with the Ace of Cups. Okay, a new energy, a, a love offer is being shown here. I'm saying, like, Cancer, you're being rewarded. You're going to be rewarded, okay? Especially with this Ace of Cups. You could also be dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So, this Ace of Cups could be a water sign, okay? A new water sign, okay, you guys? So, this... It's something that you're going to be falling in love with, with this Ace of Cups energy, okay? It's going to make you feel good. It's going to make you jump up for joy. It's going to make you excited with this Ace of Cups energy. So, so love is here. It's something new. Look, did I tell you the passion? We got the Ace of Cups and we got the passion here. So, yeah. All right, it's like you're gonna you're gonna receive a reward. Yes, so a major transformation is coming. You you guys, you know we we are in Scorpio season, okay? 
okay leaving stuff behind in order to receive something new okay sacrifice a great sacrifice okay but you had to do this in order to move on okay i'm telling you cancer you're gonna find yourself letting go of something that no longer serving serve you cancer and it's you know i'm saying like something good a transformation here all right you guys all right this is the only thing i have for you please like subscribe and share thank you